Hello my beautiful soul, welcome to a new reading. We ask the cards what is coming up for you and what is the advice how to deal with this um, new thing that will happen in your life. First of all, welcome. Second, let's see the zodiac signs for this reading. So, we have Pisces, Capricorn, Aquarius and Aries. So Pisces, Capricorn, Aquarius and Aries. All right. So let's start with some beautiful oracle cards for you. Let's see what we get. So we get the Phoenix card, which is saying be prepared to be renewed after a period of crisis. Beautiful. And with the unicorn here, success, hope, freedom, healing and magic are all available to you if you just believe. Because when you believe you are more likely to most likely to take action right to what's what needs to be done um, you are more active let's see we have here it's time to really <laughs> it's time to release negativity you see again as i said Having a positive mindset is what you need right now. And we have three cards. All right. We have look at the bigger picture. And for some here, a new romantic cycle begins. All right. Let's, let's make like this. So we can see all the cards. Hmm. Healing. I was just thinking, you know, because if you feel like you lost hope and nothing good is going to happen for you, you feel like always everything goes against you, now you must let you must let go of this kind of negative thinking. All right? You know, sometimes when things are going, we feel like are going against us. It's actually a protection. Everything happens for a reason. So don't, don't hold on too tight into what's not working in your life right now. Don't try to explain your, to yourself, not even to yourself, why certain people act the way they did with you, why certain things went the way they did. Be present in the present moment and try to, to, to focus on what is in your life right now and, and look at the hermit. Exactly. Just disconnect from anything that triggers you, that, you know, feeds this negative thinking and you have some contemplation to do here. You have some contemplation to do here with the hermit. You see, the gods are, are speaking with us so clearly. Look at the five of pentacles. The key is here. The door is closed indeed, but the key is right here. If you could only, you know, Keep your head up and just look around you. You see, don't let this negativity, all this uh, feeling of abandonment, that everything goes wrong in your life to, to isolate you. Because you actually, you can go inside. You, you, you should not be here all by yourself. But this is happening because you are overwhelmed, maybe with everything that that's happening it's understandable but you are here for a reason to hear that it's time for a change look at the judgment 
the judgment is the second chance the judgment is the card which is saying it's time to uh, f to 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 let go of old ways it's time for renewal and the phoenix card says the same thing right be prepared to be renewed after a period of crisis look how beautiful the cards are uh, coming up here two of pentacles and the ten of swords so seeing the two of pentacles immediately i thought about you do a lot right and you may say i don't have time to think positively or i don't have time to take my things and go i don't have time to deal with this and that you must there is always a way right so imagine that i don't know you as you go to work every day you must if you don't you will lose your job the same make this change in your life don't say i don't have time find time you can squeeze some time it's a lot going on but you've got this you can do this ten of swords here shows that you've got the strength to get up and walk away from anyone anything that um, that that hurt you that disappointed you that yeah did you wrong it is your choice And you can totally move away from this. Look at the lovers. For some of you, because we have the lovers, we have a new romantic cycle begins here. For some of you, this can be a new person, a new relationship coming in, right? As you may f be all by yourself right now, the biggest surprise here is that someone is entering into your life when you least expect, right? Ooh, ten of cups look at this uh, ten of pentacles sorry from five to ten of pentacles as you may be all by yourself and maybe you are not indeed all by yourself but you feel like every uh, there is no one for you look what's going to happen look what's going to happen i mean the ten of pentacles is the card of fulfillment of having more than you thought you will great achievements and the chariot here again shows that this change that you are being shown right now that you must do you must um, embrace you must say all right it's time for a new me stay strong stay focused be confident and make the change the chariot shows that you will be all right. Everything will be better than you think. Knight of Cups. Again, for some of you here, you may meet someone you or maybe you already know the person, but you start to make time. Maybe there is someone that you always say, nah, no, I don't have time. I have so much to do. And this is this person just don't doesn't give up. They want to meet with you. They want to talk with you. They want to offer you something. Three of Wands. Great expansion and growth. So, Ten of Swords shows that exactly the end of a big crisis in your life. You finally find the strength to get up, to to ask more for yourself find more time for maybe meeting with this person find more time for the things that are truly important for you and slowly slowly you recover you see with the unicorn here you must believe if you believe anything is possible just look at this the knight of pentacles you know, the slowliest night, but slowly and steady wins the race. That's true. 
So you are not in a hurry here. You just, you know, you just have to start. Most of us, we don't start. We don't even start and we already are like, oh, this is not going to work. Release that negativity. Give yourself the chance. Don't give up before you start. Let's see a little bit more. We have, oh my goodness, we have the ring here. Do you see there is something here going on? If you are single, you won't be single no more. The lovers and your romantic cycle begins. Cycle, the word cycle, look at this, twice. Totally, totally different decks. A new cycle, definitely. What do we have? The garden. Now, with the garden, you may go somewhere, you may meet with friends, family, colleagues. You may find yourself in a situation, invited somewhere. You may not have the mood, but you have to go. And as you go, there you might meet, you know, the person. Or that you're going to hear something. Something that will change things around for you in a such a wonderful way. Next, we have the book here. And the book is all about, mm, you know, what's true for you. You know you deserve better? Yes. Then start acting in that direction. With the book here, it's like you already know what you have to do. You just have to accept the fact that Mm. instead of having a negative mindset, blaming, right? Staying there and blaming. I'm like this because of you, because of that. You choose to become active, to use all your wisdom, all your life experience and turn things around in your favor. This is the real change. When you don't talk about what happened to yourself, when you don't look, you don't let the past experiences to define who you are right now and why you are in this situation. Past. It's past. It happened. Now you have the ship. You see, the ship is all about adventure. You see, journey, travel, definitely here. You make time, you find a way to take an invitation to go somewhere. This is the beginning of this new, beautiful, great period in your life. Your last car here is the house. Now the house is all about stability, right? Your foundation. So three of wands shows the expansion, shows that you get up with a ten of swords after a difficult period in your life. And you rebuild yourself up again. And it will be something stable. It will be something for that will last in time. It is not something temporarily. No way. My beautiful soul, your cards are wonderful. The message, just amazing. Thank you so much for being here with me. If this resonates with you, please like. Your likes help me a lot and I appreciate that. Uh, subscribe if you haven't done it yet and can't wait to see you next time i wish you all the best take care of yourself love and light